What does organic mean to you? Organic food production has been around for a very long time, longer than most people think, and that perception has changed over time. Organic food production started out as a symbiosis between healthy soil and healthy plants to promote good food and holistic production. And while that still exists in the world, there are several others that are associated with organic food. That definition of organic production means lots of different things to lots of different people. People who grow organic food tend to take it from a holistic approach with nature, with the soil. People who buy this, like you and I, we want organic to be something. And sometimes that definition fits what the product is and sometimes it doesn't. The USDA has a very strict definition of what organic can and cannot be. And you have to fit perfectly into those guidelines in order to be organically produced. We believe that we can grow both organically and conventionally in order to produce enough food for everyone everywhere so that we can all enjoy fresh, healthy produce. Now there's nothing wrong with organic production and there's nothing wrong with conventional production. Both of these methods are used to create safe, healthy food that everyone consumes. When using hydroponics, although we're allowed to be organic, we do things very clean and some things even better than organic. We wanna make sure that we don't use any harmful pesticides, that we don't use any harmful chemicals, and that we're only using the things that plants can get in nature to promote those plants and their growth. By doing this, we are just as clean and in some ways cleaner than organic food production. And we can bring a good, healthy plant to your table in less time, all year round. The hydroponic greenhouses that we use in ag tech allow us to grow on a much smaller footprint than any arable land produce. This greenhouse is one acre and we can produce up to 26 acres of produce. We can also do that year round. So when fields go fallow in the wintertime, we're still pumping out fresh produce. And since we're smaller, we can do it right next door to the people that need this food. Our plants grow in a system and part of that system are these walls. They're not just plastic barriers, they are temperature protecting, light diffusing bug blockers. And they make sure that our plants stay happy, cozy inside and away from all the bad things outside. These can be pathogens, these can be diseases, these can be bugs, and they can be adverse environments, but they don't happen in our greenhouse. Keeping things consistent is another key part of the process in hydroponic food production. We make sure that our plants are grown year round in a continuous harvest. And that method allows us to bring fresh produce to a local market any day of the year. This product starts down a process weeks ahead of time. And we have to be thinking way to the forefront to ensure that we have product yesterday, today, and tomorrow. These plants over here were planted last week. They're about seven days old. And then we can go right next door and these plants are a week older than that. So now I have a harvest guaranteed to provide fresh, healthy, delicious produce to local markets on a consistent level every day of the year. Growing in a high quality hydroponic greenhouse means we can produce high quality greenhouse lettuce and produce. All of our plants have a significant quality. They don't compete for nutrients. They don't compete for light. They all grow in their own nice microclimate, just like a little spa for plants to keep them happy and healthy until they're ready for you. While we love bringing you fresh, healthy produce, we are even more excited to be working to conserve and protect our environment. This means using less water, less land, and less energy to bring you more produce. That produce is non-chemical dependent and pesticide free when it gets to you. This means that we work in union with our environment to make sure that we're giving back more than we're taking out. At the end of the day, we just wanna make sure that we bring you safe, healthy, nutritious food right from our farm, right to your local community. If you have any questions or comments, leave them below, and we'll see you next time on Spill the Greens.